G'day, Daryl Nicholson here. Welcome to the pilot episode of Sports Talk, brought to you by the Toowoomba Sports Club. I'm at the Great Western Bar, and on today's show, I'm going to talk to a couple of the imports who've been brought to Toowoomba to play for the Mountaineers. Stay tuned. G'day, welcome along to Sports Talk, brought to you by the Toowoomba Sports Club, and I'm here with Damon Bozeman. How are you, mate? Good, how are you doing? Man? Going well, going well. Mate, welcome to Toowoomba. You've been here now for, what, a couple of months now? Three months? Yeah, yeah about three, three and a half months, yeah. Three months, okay. Mate, tell us the story. What, how did you get approached to come to this beautiful garden city, the, be- the most beautiful city in, Toowoom- in, the, in Australia? How did you get involved to get to Toowoomba? Um, it was it was crazy how things happened. Um, they originally signed a different import by the name of Demetrius, I think. Yep. But he ended up getting hurt back at home. Okay. So um, Danny contacted my agent asking for um, anybody to play. And yep. you know, luckily I was free. It was mm-hmm. like two weeks before the season. I just came straight out. Right, okay. Did you know much about Toowoomba before you got it? No, I didn't know nothing at all about Toowoomba. Um, I actually thought I was in Brisbane. Right, so okay. So I wasn't sure. I just seen us driving on the freeway and I seen us driving opposite of Brisbane. Yeah. So I'm pretty sure I went to Brisbane to be born. So, mate, John and Jackie Armstrong have got behind positive choices and you've been getting out into the community, into the schools. Tell us a bit about that program. Um, it's a great experience, one, first, just because you're helping out the youth. Yep. Um, just giving them um, insight of just how to be a positive kid, how to um, make positive decisions. Mm-hmm. And um, that's just what we had back at home is something similar because mm-hmm. um, you always get guys coming in, athletes coming in, speaking to the younger kids. Yep. And um, just to be able to do that, it, it, it's, it's incredible. And um, I like to do it. I love to do it. And it's, it's nothing else to say. It's, it's great. great. It's good. And how far have you been? Have you been out to Dolby or have you, have you been just uh, focusing on Toowoomba? No, time? no, no. We actually have been out to Derby and it's, um, yep. it's another school. I can't remember the name. Yep. Oak, Oak, not Oakie. Oakie? Yeah, I think maybe yeah, Oakie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we yeah, have been out that's out a little bit out in the surroundings, about an hour out, mm-hmm. just speaking to all those different um, kids out in that area and stuff. We haven't did too much stuff in Toowoomba, yep. but we usually go out to the um, out, outskirts. Right, okay. And mate, tell us about home. Where are you from? I'm from Detroit, Michigan. Detroit, the home of E.T., Eric Thomas. Yeah. Thank God it's Monday. <laughs> Man, I love that guy. I got my photo taken with him. <laughs> He's, he's really? just brilliant. So, yeah. Have you met E.T.? No, I haven't. No, I haven't. No, no. I've I seen, I seen his stuff, and uh, it, it, it is amazing. Mate, I started saying, thank God it's Monday, and people are like, you're sick, Nicholson. You're sick. It's got to be, thank God it's Friday. But I love waking up every morning and enjoying life, and I think E.T.'s on the right channel, you know, on the right track. Thank God it's Monday. Yeah, it's, it's true. That is true, because no, it's the first day of the week. Mm-hmm. You got to start it off good. Yep, yep. So, mate, in Detroit, um, I believe life is... It's tough over there. Yeah. yeah, yeah so, yeah. Um, tell us, what were you doing before? You played basketball most of your life. What, what were you doing work-wise? Oh, man, just really coaching up kids, doing yeah. the um, coaching clinics um, mm-hmm. around the Detroit area. Um, just like what I kind of do here with the Positive Choice. Yep. Just make, helping kids do the... Um, make the right decisions. Yep, okay. And that's really it, because that's a big problem in um, Detroit and the community, is just making sure that the youth yep. is making the right decisions, because that's our future. That is, that is, mate. That, that is so true, and um, if you can just give a little bit inch by inch, you can make a difference in someone's life. True, true, and that's how I feel, too, and that's really why I love to do that. And, um, even if you don't, you know, you don't get paid for doing that stuff, it may not be big money, but yep. that just determines our future. Mm-hmm. Right? You, Mate, I want to thank you for coming on Sports Talk today, and I really do appreciate it. Toowoomba Sports Club, you, you come down here every Monday and Friday for the media scrimmages. Um, you had a meal here? Yeah, um, it's absolutely amazing. I get a meal every time I come. <laughs> <laughs> Great stuff. Mate, look, thanks for coming on the show. I really appreciate it. We're going to take a short break, and um, I'll have another one of the Mountaineers. I'll have a chat to you, so stay tuned after the promo. Hi. Every Wednesday night. Would you dance in there, in there? Oh, sunshine, you are my sunshine. Let it in, let it in. Oh, sunshine, you are my sunshine. They see where this goes. I need a light to see. You to know sunshine, you are sunshine, it's another one. I wanna wake up, there's more than just friends. Sunshine, you are just sunshine, let it be, let it be. 
Welcome back to the Sports Talk, brought to you by the Toowoomba Sports Club. Danasia Fountain, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Good, I got that name right. That's right. <laughs> That's well, right. Welcome to Sports Talk. Um, Danasia, Toowoomba Mountaineers, um, been an incredible season. You're very incredible on the court. I, I, what, I've been... I can't believe we've done eight home games. We're up to the ninth game tonight. That's, yeah, that's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. But um, tell us a bit about where you're from. Um, I'm from Boston, Massachusetts. Boston. Okay. Yeah, cool. Yeah. Grew up there all your life. Yeah, yeah. I grew up there all my life. Um, so I went off to play college basketball when I was 17. Yep. Then my freshman year at Georgia Tech in Atlanta, Georgia. Yep. Um, and then after my freshman year, I went off to play in Philadelphia at Temple University, where I pursued my uh, my degree, my bachelor's degree there. Yep. Played an incredible three years there. Um, had a time in my life. Yep. Okay. Right. So how did you get to come to Toowoomba, to the most beautiful city in Australia? Ha ha. Ra come on, tell us. <laughs> what happened? Um, no, my agent just gave me a call. Yep. Um, my agent's a really good guy. And, yep. Um, I kind of hit him with some unexpected news, like out of nowhere. Like, okay, I wasn't supposed to play overseas until this like fall time which is coming up soon about a month yep. or two in the states and a couple months ago I had him with like I'm, I'm ready to, to you know to enjoy my summer which is summer in the states yep. elsewhere get prepared for my overseas jobs and um he hit me up he's like all right you know we'll find I'll find something for you and yep. he hit me up about a week later after that conversation with this opportunity so I just jumped on it yep but, Okay, so how are you enjoying your time in Toowoomba so far? Um, it's alright. Mm -hmm. It's yeah, alright. Um, it's, it's a great opportunity for basketball. Yep. I'm excited to pursue my career. And, Good. And um, I learned a lot while I've been here about myself and about people. Yep. So um, I'm just ready to move on mm -hmm. and, and go on to the next job. Yeah, excellent. Toowoomba a Sports Club Mountaineers and um, Clyde Berg off Mountaineers. But John and Jackie Armstrong with Positive Choices. Tell us a bit about that. Have you been involved much with the Positive Choices program? Yeah, I have been. Um, actually, actually, we actually went off to a few schools since I've been here yep. and talking to the kids about it. And I think it's a really great thing. Um, when we go, I'm like really in tune with the kids because when yep. I love kids yep. and the fact that we're we're using basketball as an outlet yep. to for like a, to reach out to these kids yep. and, and advertise something so meaningful and so important. Yep. Positive choices is is a really great thing that John is doing. He's a great yep. guy. Yep. He goes out of his way all yep. the time, and um, and he. He does an awesome job. Yeah, um, I, I love being a part of that. Good. I'm happy to have the team. Well, there you go. Look, I want to thank you for coming on the show today, and I um, appreciate your time. And I'm glad you're enjoying your stay in Toowoomba. It is, it is the most beautiful city in Australia. I've got a real heart for it. Uh, so. Is this where you're from? Yeah, I've grown up here most of my life. So, uh, yeah. That's why you think that. <laughs> yeah, that's right. So, yeah, no, look, thanks for coming on Sports Talk today. And um, again, brought to you by the Toowoomba Sports Club. Um, really want to thank um, Damon and. Um, um, Danasia. <laughs> really want to thank um, Damon and Danasia for coming on the show today. I really do appreciate your time. I forget that name right. Bye. Thank you. Have Take nice care. Moment.